So for today's pack ripping, we got ourselves a booster box of Crimson Haze. So for whatever reason, the vendor I ordered, I actually ordered three. He ran out of stock and all he could send me was one. He reimbursed me the other ones. Anyways, there's a couple, I think there's probably like two or three really cool trainers in this one. And I know there's the secret art rare Greninja that everybody's chasing after. Um, and I will admit the art rare of the Ursa Luna is pretty, pretty dope. So stick with me guys as we rip this bad boy open. Uh, I think there's what? 20 packs in here? Five cards in each pack. And uh, yeah, it's just like, I love Japanese cards. They're just that much better. And don't forget, here's the art on the box, the booster box. Let's rip this bad boy open. And by the way, I've been having all kinds of trouble. Uh, I initially tried to order some of this through Amazon. Because like I think I told you, you guys in one video, I do order some of my cards from Amazon. And uh, they, like, I have a trusted seller. I know one of the guys was asking me which seller do, seller. Do I trust on Amazon? Last Samurai is usually who I go through. Um, I've never had any issues whatsoever when it comes to um, like actual like stock, if that makes any amount of sense. So let's get into it. This is going to be the first booster pack of Crimson Haze. Let's check it out. Nose pass. We got ourselves an Eevee. Tangaloo. Ooh, we got an Infernape. There is, oh, there's an Infernape freaking uh, art rare in this set that is like, I'd say A1. It's actually really dope. I've been watching a lot of pack rips on TikTok at work, Nine Tails, Halucha. But uh, there's uh, the Infernape that I'm like, bro, that's actually pretty nice. So let's get into it. Hopefully we get, we get some bangers out of this box. We got a spinner rack. All right, let's see. Turkle. We got our first EX. Mad Cargo. <clears throat> Next one. So that's our first EX. I think <clears throat> from what I was seeing, there's like usually like 11 hits per box. So it makes me wonder what our big hit for this box is. Froki, Flittle, Glaceon. And then we got our little self little radar. Let's go. Next pack. I'm trying not to be as messy. Ten growth. All right. Let's see. Oh, I thought I saw something. No. It got me good. But how's you guys' days going, man? Because let me tell you, I'm having an amazing day. It's pretty freaking good. We're probably going to, uh, by we, me and Buck Wiley, are going to film episode two of the podcast tonight. Hopefully that goes well, which I think it will. Because it's always, let me tell you, it's a lot of fun hanging out with Buck. She is kind of crazy, if I do say so myself. All right, so we got Growlithe. All right. So we got a Ursaluna EX and a Snorlax. We're not doing too bad. Mind you, this is the left side of the box. Usually all of our luck's on the right side of the box. That's all I got to say. Let's keep on going. Tangela. Froki. If I can get it to... Boom. Well, there's our Ace spec. It looks like a stamp. There we go. And there's, there's one of the trainers I was talking about. So we got our Ace spec out of the box on the left side. So hopefully that means our hit will be on the right side. Because it makes me wonder if we're going to get something magnificent. Boom. All right. All right. So we haven't hit anything other than the ace spec and two EXs so far. So maybe, maybe there's big things in store for us. Spin a rack again. Vulpix. Ooh. Ooh. The second half of the box might be spicy. 
if uh if it's looking like this but yeah so like i said halucha we're gonna be filming episode two of the podcast tonight all sinistry well it looks like that might be the box hit right there and uh don't forget to go check it out it's called e-man on we uh we're we fell behind because week two we i was busy my mom was in town my birthday all kinds of craziness there's a poke bowl so like i said we'll have to see we'll have to see how schedules line up and everything if because I want to try to crank out at least uh, one episode a week. We'll see. Oof. Nope. All right. So we got two packs left on the left-hand side of this box. It's making me wonder if they drew back on the uh, the pull rates. Because let me tell you, the last couple uh, sets, the pull rates have been astronomical. There's a Zapdos. Love ball. All right, second to the last on the left, and then we're moving to the right. All right, let's go. So we got Nine Tails, Growlithe, Flittle. Ooh, that's a good one. I actually like the art on this. That is a really nice one. I like that pincer. Um, I'm trying to think the other. Like I said, the Ur there's an Ur Ursa Luna. Um. Freaking art rare that is amazing. There's Halucha, Nine Tails. Let's go. Boom, boom. Okay. So guys, we did okay on the first half. I think we got our our uh, box hit and our A spec on the left hand side, and we are getting ready to go onto the right hand side. Tab bulb, ten growth, <laughs> belly bolt. I do. I think Belly Bolt's probably one of my favorites from uh, Scarlet and Violet thus far. Uh, belly Bolt. So, Graf Greg. Uh, Froakie's brother. And Snorlax. Helldivers. Sorry, I was looking at... Uh, I was getting an invite on my PC. I guess one of my buddies saw me get on. Sent me an invite to Helldivers. I'm not, I'm not going to be playing tonight. Eevee. There is an Eevee art rare in this. That is amazing. If I can get the camera to focus. Focus. There we go. So that's two. I think we have one more art rare that we could potentially get. So I'm torn between the Eevee and the Infernape. So... Magmortar. Halucha. And boom. Glaceon. Bam. Let's go. Let's go. So we got Froki. I got another notification. I keep getting inundated. More Pico, more Peco. Bam. Let's go. We're about halfway through the right-hand side. We're not doing too terribly bad. Boom. Growlithe. And I don't know what that one's called. More Pico, more Peco. I don't know why that's like stuck in my head. Stuck in my head. So we got an Arcanine. The Thuian. If I can get it to focus. That's actually a really nice one. And. Bam. Yeah, I was hoping to do like a big old opening on this. Because like I. I Like I said, I've been watching it on Iron Thorns. On TikTok. So if you guys don't know, I love watching pack openings on TikTok. For whatever reason, like, let everybody else spend their money. Like I said, save your money. Let everybody else spend theirs. I'm not sure if there's actually something behind this. Spinarak. Nope, Leafeon. That's actually really nice art for that Leafeon. I like it. We're down to our last four. This is five packs left. I'm, like, trying to do the math real quick and look. 
Infernape. I do like the Infernape art as well. I mean the uh Ooh, me if he I'm <laughs> sorry, it's been a long day. This new job has been getting me bogged down, man. So we got Pincer, Nine Tails. We got another EX. There's a Greninja EX. And we're down to our last three packs, you guys. All right, which one should we do? Right, left, center. I'm feeling center. All right. Let's go. That's the other thing I like is, like, Japanese packs are super easy to open. We got Flittle. Nose pass. Ooh, that's nice. Walking wake. Right or left? Right it is. Let's go. I love opening cards. That's like one of the downsides to me is like I absolutely love opening cards. <laughs> Excuse me. Pincer. Manfi. Snorlax. And Love Ball. Last pack magic, you guys. We could potentially get like a bonus hit. You never know. You never know. Is this going to be last pack magic or bust? That's the real question. Eevee. Ten growth. Turkle. And it was a bust. No. Anyways, you guys, thank you so much for coming and hanging out. It really does mean a lot to me. Don't forget to mash the like button. Subscribe. Comment down below. What was your favorite card in this opening? Or if you've opened this set, what is the favorite your favorite card that you've gotten from this set? Anyways, you guys, I'll catch you guys later. Bye.